So in rectal malformation is a condition whereby the anus and the rectum is not formed normally. In the boys, the commonest form of in rectal malformation is when the rectum is connected to the urinary pipe. So this is what we call a high anomaly and these boys do not have an anal opening. So when they are born, when there's no anal opening, they will require something called a colostomy. A colostomy is an opening of the intestine into the skin so that the feces can come out and that allows the child to feed and evacuate the feces into a bag. That's only temporary until the reconstructive surgery is done for the anorectum so that they have a new opening that is positioned in the muscular structure that can hold the feces when required. So they're continent in the future. Laparoscopic surgery for anorectal malformation involves detaching the rectum from the urinary tract and then creating a new opening, attaching the rectum to the skin through the muscle so that there's continent mechanism later on in future. So by doing the laparoscopic surgery it involves small incision in the abdomen and so much smaller incision in the bottom part. Traditionally, the open surgery involves a cut for the boys from the scrotum right down to the spine, which is a very large incision cutting through muscles. And that is the most painful part, cutting muscles. In this situation whereby there's hardly any cuts in the muscle, the recovery is so much faster and most importantly, the child undergoes minimal pain.